teach in the field of psychology, um, and I think that psychology is just a natural fit for what students care about in the HDO program because what we study is uh, human behavior. And I think that anyone who wants to have a deep understanding of how people work in groups and organizations is going to benefit from having a deep, scientifically grounded understanding of human behavior. There are a number of topics that we study that have relevance, I think, to a student who's interested in the HDO program. So, for example, our students take evidence-based evaluations to identify their character strengths. Character strengths range from wisdom, perspective, creativity, leadership, and we discuss ways in which understanding, knowing, and using personal strengths both in your personal life and your professional life can bring about enhanced well-being. And there's certainly been some interest in applying that perspective to the workplace because we know that when people feel that they're using their strengths, that they're performing at their best, that they're flourishing, they're not only happier in the workplace but also more productive. Another topic that we study is this really interesting phenomena called flow. Flow is the state of deep attention, concentration, focus that people sometimes achieve, especially when they're involved in an activity that involves a high level of challenge and for which they have a high level of skill. So sometimes people who are rock climbing will report on having this artists, surgeons, variety of professions. And there has been interest in looking at how aspects of flow might be better understood so that we can promote flow experiences in the workplace and therefore, again, enhance not just individual well-being but productivity as well. Mm -hmm.